What is up, guys? And you are welcome to another installation of On UGTV, where I bring to you the craziest of happenings in the footballing world. But in today's video, it's going to be all about the UEFA Champions League. I'm going to be giving you guys my predictions for the teams that will be making it to the round of 16 and my reaction to the draws. Now, before we get right into that, some crazy things came out of last week. Some um, footballs in the form of um, new signings, such as so Genio Des who has signed from um Ajax to Barcelona defender finally he will be wearing the number two jersey in the Barcelona squad and uh, Sheffield United have also landed a new signing in the form of um Ryan Brewster from Liverpool we do wish him the best of luck in his new club also, a loan deal from Chelsea to Aston Villa came in the form of Rose Barkley. No one saw that coming. That was crazy when it came out. And also in England, Manchester City have also landed a new signing in the form of Ruben Diaz, a defender who will be wearing the number three shirt. He came from um, Lazio, so we do wish them the best of luck. And now into the main video. And some little information you guys should know before we get straight right into the main video. March day one of the UEFA Champions League is just three weeks away, where it's gonna hold on um, the 20th and 21st. Then we move into the 27th, 28th, March day two, November 3rd, 4th. March day 3, November 24th and 25th, March day 4, October the 1st, 2nd and um, 8th and 9th would we'll see March day 5. Now um, the finals have been said that it's going, the finals rather, it's set to hold in Istanbul, Turkey where it was supposed to hold last um, season but due to the coronavirus it uh, wasn't able to hold but this season it will be holding in Istanbul. Istanbul, Turkey at the Atatak um, Olympic Stadium. Um, so yeah, that is some one that we're gonna look uh, really, really forward to seeing. And now into my predictions for the round of 16. I had to look at all of this um, group stage, um, groups rather, very, very well. And I have come with my 16, the 16 teams that will be making it to the round of 16, the knockout stage. Now in Group A, we have Bayern Munich, Atletico Madrid, Salzburg, Sla and At Locomotive Moscow. Bayern and Atletico for me are going straight to the round of 16. No arguments there, but I feel Bayern Munich are going to dominate their group um, for sure. Then we move all the way to Group B. Real Madrid, Real Madrid, um, Shaska, Donetsk, um, Inter Milan, and Munchen Glad Batch. Okay, just forget about that. <laughs> forget about that. For um, Group B, Real Madrid and Athletic and um, Inter Milan. Sorry, and Inter Milan will be moving to the round of 16. But um. With the way things are going, I feel Inter Milan are going to stay on top of their group. Uh, this the South Cardinals guys. Um, I have watched them play before. They are actually very good. But um, if we're talking realistically here, I would say Real Madrid and Inter Milan. But I feel Inter are going to dominate their group. Group C came in the form of Porto, Manchester City, Olympiacos, and Marseille. Olympiacos, Marseille, Manchester City, Porto. Now, firstly, I'm gonna pick Man City to go to the round of 16. Firstly, Man City as the first. Um, ooh, Olympiacos was with um, Barcelona last season. Yeah, oh, was it the opposite season? Yeah, we're with Barcelona. Um, 
who so this go this was a tough one this is a tough one this is a tough one i'm going to go with marseille i'm going to go with marseille just because of the way they dominated psg and their opening game of the season i'm going to go with manchester city and marseille to the round of 16 and now in group d we have liverpool ajax atalanta and mid Zealand. um Mm, Atalanta, Mid Zealand, at uh, Ajax, Liverpool. First of all, Liverpool will be making it to the round of 16. Hopefully, they can perform. They haven't. Their yeah, um, performance in the Premier League has. They haven't lost any match though. But um, it, they have been shaky. They did lose to Arsenal in um, in the Carabao Cup. Don't want penalties, but um. They will be going for me to the round of 16, but between Atalanta and Ajax, mm, Ajax did perform um, the season before, um, last season, they did really well, they did go out early last season, so did Liverpool. I'm going with Antalanta here. Antalanta and Liverpool for the round of 16 in Group D, but I feel strongly that Antalanta might dominate their group just because of the way they performed last season. Uh, I don't know. You guys should leave in the comment section below between uh, Ajax and Atalanta, which club, which club you think is going on? Um, all the way to the round of 16 but i feel liverpool and atalanta will be going to the round of 16. now in group e oh, nah i'm just Seville and chelsea i'm not really going to waste time here joe chelsea chelsea might uh chelsea though no, okay uh kepa might not be in goal <laughs> hopefully for them kepa might not be in goal but um Sevilla chelsea for me for group e Sevilla and chelsea and then this group second to the last group this group really brought up some arguments which i and my friends zenith dortmund um lazio and club bruges club bruges lazio dortmund and zenith firstly i'm going to go with dortmund brochure dortmund um for me they would um they might dominate their um they might dominate their their group but um Lazio Zenit. Lazio Zenit. Okay, wait, this is not a group that brought up um arguments. Okay, no, this is not a group. Uh take his group H. That's that's not a group I'm going to. Dortmund for me will move and Lazio. Lazio and Dortmund Lazio um bringing out um their golden boots winner being in Mobile for last season in um Syria. So yeah, he and um Dortmund and ha they still have Ed and Holland in their team. So yeah, let's see how um, that's a combination goal. But for group F Dortmund and Lazio to the round of sixteen. Group G Group G Group G Barcelona my favorite favorite um Group Barcelona and Juventus. Finally, finally, what every Messi and Ronaldo fans have been waiting for to see these two great icons clash again in a football pitch. This is going to be very, very interesting. The two of them are going straight around of 16. No arguments there. I don't really know the other teams, but Barcelona and Juventus. The thing about Barcelona. If we're having a bad season, one way or the other, we still find a way to make it to the round of 16. So yeah, Barcelona and Juventus for me will be moving to the round of 16. And then our last group in for my prediction, Man um, Paris Saint-Germain, Manchester United, Leipzig and Istanbul, Basakir, Bas 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 Istanbul Basakir. Okay, yeah, this is the one. This is the group that brought up a lot of arguments uh, with I am and with I and some of my friends. I I'm going with Paris, yeah. But what we were arguing about is Manchester United and RB Leipzig. Leipzig have lost Timo Werner and Manchester United. Uh, they've been performing, but though Leipzig have been very good this season um, so far. They, I think they've lost one, drawn one, and lost two, and won two of their matches. But yeah, um, Manchester United and RB Leipzig. Uh, um, I'm going with RB Leipzig and Paris here. I'm going with RB Leipzig and Paris. 
but a lot of people did say Manchester United but um this is just my um what I feel is going to happen so yeah this is my round of 16 this is how it is looking in my round of 16 Bayern Munich and Atletico de Madrid, Real Madrid, Inter Milan, Manchester United and Marseille, Atlet um sorry Atalanta and Liverpool, Chelsea and Sevilla, Dortmund and Lazio, Juve and Barcelona, Paris Saint Germain and RB Leipzig. Now, please feel free to leave in the comment section below in each and every group which team you feel is going all the way to the round of 16. And after the group stages, I will be making another prediction video for the semis, the quarterfinals, and the finals. And that is it for RUG TV this week. If you have enjoyed the video, feel free to slap a like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And as always, enjoy yourself. Have a great day. Goodbye.